Welcome. This is the 7th um, grade TCAP practice test for math. This is question number 11. The question says, what is the value of 8.50p plus 7.99c when p equals 15 and c equals 6? What they're asking us to do here is substitute, which is not the same thing as that person that comes in when your teacher's sick and then you like play jokes on them and pretend you're somebody else or throw stuff. In this case, what they're asking us to do is to just put the values of p and c in once they give it to us. And they did here. They said p is 15 and they said C is 6 so what we need to do is think about what relationship the P has to 8.50 and I almost laughed when I said that I'm sorry but um, if they're touching which they are here the zero is touching the P ha 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 and uh, in that case if hamsters touch if you have male and female hamsters and they touch they're multiplying so the case same case here it's a multiply question what you can do in your calculator which is kind of nice is just make sure that you write out the statement 8 0.50 and when you have that uh, variable there what you want to do is make a parentheses so I'm going to put parentheses here because if you put something in parentheses next to another number it means they're multiplying so that's exactly what we need to do right and I'm going to do the same thing with 7.99 I'm going to put parentheses there all I've got to do now is make sure I put the right thing in the right spot well 8.50 is touching the letter P so I'm gonna put its value right there so 15 and then I'm gonna do the same thing with 6 um, if you're using the TI 30x or whatever you can type it all in you don't even have to type that 0 there but if you want to uh, you want to type in 8.50 that's fine just make sure that you close your parentheses after the number and make sure that you always kind of use the parentheses. Sometimes it makes it a little more complicated as things as you get a little older, but it also makes it so you don't make so many mistakes, particularly when the thing you're substituting in is a negative. Anyway, I typed it all into my handy dandy calculator here, and I hit the enter button, and I got 175.44, and that is exactly the answer that I'm looking for because the answer to number 11 is, of course, C.